Okay, I'm here with uh, former cruiserweight champion Bobby Gunn. He's, he's about to fight Roy Jones, and uh, you would call this the biggest professional fight of your career? This is a super fight. You know, Roy Jones Jr. is like Michael Jordan of basketball. Critics can say that, and critics can say this, but at the end of the day, I'm the one fighting Roy Jones Jr. And this fight will not be let down. Styles makes fights. If you look at boxing history, the people that are critics and say they overlook a fight, that's the fight that goes, oh my gosh, that was a barn burner. This is that fight right there. It's the mystique of it, the smell of it. It's the atmosphere. I smell it, and I'm not going to let down. I will be victorious in this fight. Uh, um, you've been out of the uh, you know, uh, pro boxing ring for, for quite a while, but you say you, you stay busy well, I, with banging off of boxing. I, I keep sharp. You know, I, like I, I fought about a year year 14 months ago, year and 14 months ago, but you know, I'm never out of the gym. I don't smoke or don't drink. Everybody knows it about me. I've lived a clean life. That's what saves me. You know what I mean? And I don't party. So my parties with my boy and my little girl and my wife. That's what, you know, I look forward to every day. Besides that, I'm a training hound. I don't, you know, I keep myself in shape. So I'm, I'm fresh. I'm a lot fresher, I think, than Roy. And I think you're going to see that coming December the 4th. What's your, um, uh, uh, up a record? I never lost. You know, I, I had a lot of fights. I, I don't want to say too much because it scares my opponents away. But I was, on, I was, I was at, here's why I like that bare knuckle fights. There's no quick stoppages like boxing, the you know politics. That I've been in fights. I've been involved in controversial fights that stopped for no reason. Like you know, I fought Thomas Adamak. There's no reason to stop that fight. Watch that fight in the fourth round. You know, it was a joke to stop that fight. Absolutely. You know, I mean, but bare knuckle. I never see. They don't. Here's how. Here's how a fight stop. When the man's knocked out and he says, "I give up." That's when a fight stop. And that to me is a manly thing. You go out in your shield, but this fight is going to be fair, even Steven. I got good people behind me. They're going to make sure nothing crooked goes on. It's a great atmosphere. It's one of the best states in the world, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, for boxing. And they got the best commissioner in the world, Greg Sir. Okay. Uh, was fighting in uh, Philadelphia because you know we don't get a lot of uh, high-profile fights these days. Uh, to be honest, I mean we get local things, but you rarely can we bring you know a superstar like Roy Jones to Philadelphia. Um, I mean, how did how did you get him here? Well, you got Bobby Gunn here now too. So so this is the listen. Rocky was a movie, but December the fourth is going to become a reality. It has that same drama, that same cinema screen to it. And you'll see. Right, I guess he's Apollo Creed. But I'm going to be a Rocky too. I'm going to the winner. This <laughs> yeah, okay. All right. Well, best of luck to you. Thank you, my friend. God bless you now. Appreciate it. Thank you.